Yo. Crab Brave. Crab Brave is right. entertainment coming in here demanding things we just started dude how dare you make demands no it's my day off potatoes are all rp'd out No hour off? Oh, okay. I have a list. You have a list of demands? Mans came in prepared today. Nah. Open. Pokemon. My message got flagged. Oop, did it? I was just setting up some. Oh, there it is. Oh, that's fine. Streamlabs caught Dusty. Oh no! You got time you got timed out by Streamlabs. I saw the message though, right as it went to time you out. Get out of here, bot. Nobody wants you. Fudge you streamlabs. I didn't catch it in time, so it like auto did it. Yeah. What? I thought of I thought of a flag for actually golden, which isn't a joke and it's actually true, and in my heart I believe in it. Oh no. He's arrow. I can see that. Yes. And I don't know. Yep, why. there's a party tonight in chat, war tomorrow. So you're like throwing a party before you start a war? Check Discord DMs, but you gotta add the three winky faces, man. You gotta make it sound real sus. <laughs> so many winky faces. Oh no. We're naming at least one of these Pokemon penis. Okay, yes. Dusty, we can name a Pokemon penis. Looks good, Mikey. Okay, let's switch over to... It always does this. It like auto, auto puts it as like the one window I don't want it to be. Boop. They don't call me Susty Raider for nothing. True. Man does be sus. Gotta fix the cropping on this game. What the heck's going on here? I'm a good streamer. I know what I'm doing.
There we go. Should be good to go now. I can't remember which button. I already forgot what button it is. This is what happens when the two em the two games I play are on different emulators. Bum, 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 bum. Load that one. Wrong button. Okay, so this one's A, A then. Let me see. It's a lot of candies, potato. Play crab wave for the party? No. No. Okay, what were we doing? Um. Oh yeah, we caught it Abra and named it Horse. And we needed to level up Leaf. Because I don't think we beat the... Yeah, no, we didn't beat Misty yet. Okay, now I remember what we were doing. I need more caffeine. Nothing bad happens, and then it's like a dolphin kid. Just a fluffy one-shot? Yes. I don't know why. I just- the idea of this is just like, it's just not happening, but it's never gonna happen. I mean, that's how like, fanfiction became a whole thing to begin with, is like, people like, saw characters going through stuff, and they're like, traumatic characters, and they're like, you, these characters deserve to be happy, I'm going to write them into a happy scenario. What the fuck, are we just gonna make our own characters into fanfics? I mean, if they're your characters and you're doing that, though, then it can it's, be canon. It's canon. It's canon. It's, canon it's just, it's story brain. adjacent canon, you know? It's canon in Jordan's brain. I'm making an interview. This is what he imagines. Oh, okay. That's actually going to make me excited. How dare be grateful that the war isn't tonight, because I can start the war. I mean, you could, but there's no one There's no one there for you to fight right now, so it would be kind of uh, anticlimactic, if I'm being honest. Cause like Dusty's in chat, but he 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 fell into the, the the pond water and turned into a bunch of frogs and then died. So like he doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> this wild Pokemon, I'll fight Dusty. I mean, you could try. I don't know how well that's gonna go over though. How dare you! Mikey come what, flying in with a vengeance, though. What the fuck? You know, Mikey being Dusty's biggest fan and all. He'll fight the antis. <laughs> I'll fight his ghost thing. <laughs> Dusty says put up or shut up. The flex arm. Dusty out here fighting children. That's why I look up to him. <laughs> That's why you look up to him? Because he fights children? Yeah. I mean, better reason than anything else, I guess. Lol loves this. You, you can't challenge someone to a fight and then combat log. It doesn't work that way, potato. Oh, it's a child? Yeah, it's a child. I'll fight for you, Dusty. Mikey says he'll fight the child for you. Then <laughs> I'll definitely win, all caps. Oh. <laughs> no contest. I don't know what the heck my bangs are doing today. I'm 
could beat up at least three children. True, you probably could. You got the height advantage. Excuse me, I'm a toad. It's a toad child. Fight this rocket grunt to level up the... Automod keeps catching everything you guys say. I'll kick your shins. Aerial combat. Oof. Oh no, not my shins. Oh no, not potato with the nukes again. Pushes the child. <laughs> You're like, oh no, not my shins. And then Mikey just poof. <laughs> Get away from his shins. You can't combat log. It doesn't it work in real life combat. This isn't a Minecraft server. Gang gang. Can hear me. I, I heard yeah, you can kind of hear you, even from over there. Okay, I'm leaving. <laughs> Comes in long enough to push a child and then leave. If that's the most Mikey thing I've ever seen. can't fight me when, you're, when I'm offline. Yeah, but see, if you're talking in chat, then you're not offline. Also, Twitch chat is not the same thing as like a Minecraft server. You can't just log in and out to avoid getting attacked in Jesse battle. Jesse said I did good. I can fight you since you're only a door away. Oh, Mao, you done good, Mikey. Yay! You yep, praise Mikey. That's all you need to do. That's all the payment he needs. He'll oh fight any God. child for you. Just pray Call for me. Call me anytime. <laughs> you have me. Well, he doesn't. He has me on his Discord, but it's not very often. I surrender. <laughs> you threaten that they're your door away, and they suddenly surrender. Suddenly, the online fighting turns into real life fighting, and you decide to change your mind. I will fight until the day Dusty dies. Really, just became one of his like soldiers in a war that I don't know exists. Like, what's going on? I used freaking double kick on a psychic type like an idiot. Fighting doesn't work well on psychic types. Let me just pop in long enough to like fight a child and then disappear again. One sec, going to listen to Bo. I still have to watch the new Bo Burnham special. I've only like heard a few of the songs because they're like popular on TikTok, but. Um... I'm gonna watch it through. You're gonna watch it with me? Yeah. Okay, sounds good. Stay away. I am fought. Don't start, Potato. I'm and look at- away. Yeah, Ash- Potato- Potato, oh, you he's... can't come in here and- He's threatening to fight you. Yeah, as a joke in Twitch chat, don't turn it into real life violence. That's like, not okay, and against terms of service, secondly. Also, your brother's sleeping, so don't come in here starting shit. Oh, you stop. You stop then. Ashes, enough. Watch it, oh my god, tonight. I already did. It's heartbreaking, but eye-opening. It's fucking amazing. I still haven't watched it yet. Mikey wants to watch it with me. We're gonna have to- I'll probably watch it after stream.
Yeah, no, I I know I know a couple of the songs. One because they're like popular in TikTok, and two because Mikey listens to them out loud. <laughs> But um, I haven't actually watched the whole special yet. And like, I've seen all the hype about it and I've been like, meaning to. I just don't have my own Netflix. After stream, yes. Yes, I will, after stream. All I was on me is my favorite. I know a, a clip from that one is used on TikTok lots. Keep listening to it, it can't stop. I mean, Bo Burnham is really good at making songs really, really catchy, too, so, like, it- they're, like, easy to listen to over and over again. Welcome to the Internet is the realest and most depressing song, and I can't stop listening to it. True. It's super catchy, too. That one I have heard. Instagram is good and people are hating on it. People are hating on it because they're feeling called out. Because his description of a white woman's Instagram is so true. Also, How the World Works is fun. I'm not sure if I've heard that one yet. The whole special is way better if you watch it. Don't just listen. Okay, I'm gonna have to do that. It's definitely on the to-do list. Now, Dusty, which Pokemon did you want us to catch and name Penis? There's so much more than just the songs changes the vibe entirely yeah I've, I've i've read a bit about how like well it's done considering he like edited and filmed it all himself to be honest i barely laugh but it was so good. Just try to stay off your phone and watch it tonight. Okay, I'll... I'll do that. <laughs> okay, we're catching the Oddish then. Izuku Midoriya. I was thinking Harry Ball. <laughs> My gosh. Okay, well, we caught the Oddish. Me naming him Izuku Midoriya? I don't even know if that'll fit. Yeah, Izuku Midoriya is not gonna fit. Should we just call him Midoriya? Deku-kun? Okay. They don't have- there it is. gonna get upset. I thought they didn't have the dash. There you go. Deku kun it is. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> love it. Awesome. I just used the wrong electricity attack. Thunder wave is just gonna paralyze. It's not gonna do damage. Stupid poison. The one with the elephant trunk nose? It can be that. That one can be penis? I don't know if- is that a first gen Pokemon? I'm not sure. I think that might be second gen. Yeah, I think I know which one you're talking about, but I can't- I think it's a second gen, not a first gen. We could, um, go with Old Reliable and name a Metapod Penis. It's not who I meant to use it on. Supposed to be leveling up the Pikachu and I keep almost killing it and it's not helpful. High level Pidgeys are no match for my Thundershock. I just realized my music stopped playing. If we get the Pikachu high enough level, we should be able to like blast right through Misty's gym and then we can go find more new Pokemon to catch. All of these Pidgeys have Quick Attack though, and it's really, really annoying. Ooh, a Meow. We haven't caught this one yet. Catch the Meowth. I like Meowth. Caught it. Let's go. Wrong button. something good for Meowth. I can't think of anything good. Should we name it a pun? Me 
else. Could we just catch it and then if someone wants to name it, we can name it, rename it later when we get to the name raider. Are you yeah. yeah. We just caught a meow, so you want to name it something? Uh, yes. What do you want to name it? Um, name Sir Daryl. Sir what? Daryl. Daryl? Like Daryl, but with a G? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Sir Daryl. Sir Daryl. Yeah, I can see him in that. There we go. He's been named. It's the daycare. Back up. We need the Pokemon Center. You're really just on a like mood board kick with the like, book lately, huh? Finding like outfits and like tons of different things. That's fair. I mean, you've gotten most of like the other characters done. This one area has like some high level wild Pokemon, so it makes leveling up a little bit faster. True. You know, like certain people that just dress like dads, even though they're not dads. Excuse me? You're like, you heard me. You dress like a dad. What are you gonna do? Ground me? Ooh. <laughs> oh no, he's gonna take back my allowance. <laughs> Taking away my privileges. <laughs> no TV privileges for a week. I'm gonna cry. Probably because he has like a loud scary voice. Oh. I mean, <laughs> you go oh, but like honestly, like when guys are loud and have like loud and, and scary voices, like don't yell at me, I'll cry. <laughs> I probably found that hot, not gonna lie. <laughs> 
<laughs> the two reactions. They yell at you in a, like an angry voice and you're just like, oh. <laughs> they yell at me in an angry voice and I'm just like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Your daddy issues are showing, Mikey. Well, we have daddy issues too, okay? We can have daddy and mommy issues. Maybe I'll get older. Maybe you want to go fucking over there. Oh, there's a cookie. I have a scary green gal. There's a cookie too. Oh, sorry. I know a softie when I see one. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to have roses, remember, why would you have roses when you're there? I don't know, maybe he likes roses. A man can't like flowers? I'm pretty sure almost every boy has a favorite flower. Yeah, and Jordan's fucking favorite flower is roses because of its date. Like, if your favorite flower is based off your ex-girlfriend, then I mean, you might have a problem. <laughs> pick your own favorite flower, come on, man. Don't pick There's like this trend going around where people like screen record like them or, or take screen caps of like them messaging like guys that they know, mm -hmm. um, like telling them that they look pretty to see what their reaction is. And I really like, I love the idea of doing the trend, but I don't know enough guys to be able to just like message them and be like, you look pretty. I think you're pretty to see what their reaction would be. Like, I, I really need to like expand my social cir circle so I can like. You're losing like me and pretend you're doing and like just think of what some melancholy character would say. I mean, I could do that. Just like headcanon what my characters, how my characters react to someone texting them saying, "Yeah, you're pretty." Jordan, Jordan would be like, "Okay," and then inside. <laughs> Reaction? What? Inside? Oh my god, they think I'm pretty. <laughs> I have been working really hard on making myself look more presentable. I'm glad it shows. That's like the fun thing about head canoning things about your own character is that it makes it canon. If I head canon it, then it is canon because he's my character. He's like, stop it, I'm blushing. Uh, I mean, he's evolved a lot since like the uh, since I first created him. He was meant to just be like a total asshole bad guy. He was guy. supposed to be the nice brother, remember? Yeah, and, and then I then he was supposed to be like the total asshole, and then he's kind of looped around back into a weird mix of both, yeah. the nice character and it's like a bad guy. Of, yeah. I, I I hate how it's just the sandals male, but I'm seeing a lot of male feet, and I find it upsetting. I don't like it. I hate it here. I don't want to picture with Jordan's feet. I'm not into that. I'm crying. You're like, I just want to know what male sandals look like, and now I'm looking at men's feet, and it's making me very uncomfortable. People are intimidating while trying to yell at you with sandals on. What? You wear socks and you're like, he's not that many well, at least we can be sure you don't have a foot fetish, Michael. Even the guy that I'm like, is talking to me. Well, no, he gives me a guy that wears Crocs. He wears Crocs sometimes. What kind of Crocs do you wear? Mans is wearing Crocs in his house? Yep. That's why remember, like, his siblings are actually pretty funny. Because <laughs> they know he wears Crocs <laughs> in the house. <laughs> You're not scary. I know you wear Crocs like slippers. <laughs> Wouldn't you need to look up references for things, but then like the pictures you're finding are making you uncomfortable? It's also an artist problem. Uh, probably like those like strappy ones, you know, like the Velcro ones. Oh, children. <laughs> children. 
children said. <laughs> That or slides, I guess. Oh, I like the Velcro. <laughs> it's just, it's, those are the sandals you see dads wear. Or like the Velcro ones, Ooh, right? Velcro. <laughs> Did you know that heels were originally invented for men? <laughs> He's like, don't judge my heels. He high heels were invented for men. He wears like one of those like bright like red ones. Like, <laughs> bright red stilettos. Hell yeah. Run, Mans can run and jump over fences in heels. You can't <laughs> change my mind. <laughs> But like, fear the person that can chase you in You're heels, really man. Scared. Uh, nothing scares me more than like a girl that can do a kickflip in heels. I used to know a girl in high school that could uh, skateboard in heels, and she could I like. Don't, I don't know if I know how to skateboard, but I know how to. Um... She could run and like skateboard and heels, and it was terrifying. Yeah, I mean, my girl. She could like land a kickflip in heels, and I was just like, remind me never to fight her. Because not only can she run in those heels, but she could take them off and use them as a weapon if she wanted to. Hmm. So you're, what you're telling me is that you want your wardrobe to be dad aesthetic? Yeah. This is good for <laughs> I feel like it's a, I found that that's a reoccurring theme with like trans mask people is that they tend to have like dad aesthetics. Yes. He gives me vacation. You give me vacation dad vibes. Oh, I do. You literally have an, a Hawaii shirt that you were wearing yesterday. Yeah, well, this is what happened. You sort of have a shirt. I wish I was older. Like, no, I don't want to be older. Maybe younger Jordan. <laughs> Wait, no, older Jordan is big and stuffy, though. And big beard man. You're just projecting onto our fictional character now. The, the model that we picked to play Jordan. That makes sense. He's actually a really cute guy, not I find that most of the models that I picked for the characters that I want to be mean, like, actually are really nice. They just look like super serious and mean in their photos because that's modeling. If you look at his photos, he's like smiling and like, he just looks fucking adorable. When he has no face, These oddishes keep poisoning my Pikachu and it's making me mad. There's some poor guy out there that can't grow facial hair just crying in the corner because he heard you. <laughs> I have nothing to be sorry for. It's the facts. I can't help it if I want to slap their bald faces. <laughs> You're still looking at sandals. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. I'm never going to be able to write his character the same because I'm just going to think about these dramatic scenes I'm writing him in and I'm going to picture him wearing Crocs. <laughs> How could you let a man wearing Crocs kill you? I think anybody could wear Crocs. No, all these aesthetic photos that I'm looking for is all like Yeah, I've seen pictures of those people that have like uh, added like studs and like chains and stuff to black Crocs. I think you're going in the right direction with the brown Crocs. I was thinking like brown or gray. Or like a like a tan color. He doesn't wear that outgoing. He's crocs. He'd wear like a beige-colored croc. He looks like a man that would wear beige-colored crocs. Beige. Not gonna lie. Ooh, you know, you know what the brown shirt is. It's like really funny because like that sounds like an insult you'd use on someone. Like, if they made you, like, mad or they said something, like, insulting and, like, super sexist to you, you'd be like, shut up. I'm not going to take that from a man that looks like he wears beige-colored Crocs. <laughs> I feel so insulted. <laughs> Could you imagine if someone told you you look like someone who wears beige-colored Crocs? It's like, that's an insult that we need to, like, remember. Do you think he puts them in turbo? Mans wears his Crocs in four-wheel drive. Like, they're gonna go to see who made it. Oh, we're getting into the rocky terrain, trying to switch them into four-wheel drive. <laughs> Something else I can do. <laughs> yeah, he flips the little part for the back of his feet so his Crocs don't slide off. We're off-roading now, guys. I can't believe you turned our big bad character into a man that wears Crocs. I mean, in book one, though, he's the bad guy. And now he's in Crocs. Which book isn't he the bad guy? It's uh, if you're not talking about Jack Because even in Lifefield, he's considered the bad guy. I mean, he's not totally the bad guy in Shadow Maw. Oh yeah, oh yeah, all the kids like him. Except but it's like all I can pick here is Book One Jordan, <laughs> who's supposed to be like the main antagonist and bad guy. <laughs> and now I can only picture him in Crocs. I'm yeah. never gonna take his character seriously ever again. I don't know why It's just the elf voice. Could you imagine some like big guy coming up to you demanding to fight you? And he's wearing and he crocs. Down and he's wearing crocs. You better make Michael stay wearing crocs. You're like, wow, I got red ones at home. Uh, I'll be walk. damned if I'm gonna be threatened by a man in crocs. And I feel like Michael's not gonna be like that. He's gonna look at you and be like, wow, your brown ones look amazing. And Michael's not being like that. He was Tove. Tove would have been like that. <laughs> Tove. Or like Jade. Yeah. They'd both be like, I'd be damned if I'm gonna be talked down to by a man wearing Crocs. But Michael's like, wow, like don't worry. Don't you have to talk He's to like, you? I got red ones at home. All of the Omegas happen at our house. You could be part of the hours of like server pressing and we wouldn't click on you. With your Crocs. Ergo, I have a little bit of pocket money. <laughs> He's ashamed of his Crocs. We don't bring them up. We wear them when we have them. Oh no. Eric 
Patrick has navy colored Crocs. <laughs> Don't make me picture him on his motorcycle with Crocs. Like, oh my god. Uh, hey, hi, um, is it Yo Dylan? Is that what you, how you pronounce your name? How's it going? Or me and my brother are just laughing about char our character creation because he's supposed to be a big bad guy and now we are picturing him wearing Crocs throughout he his- has Crocs! Yeah, my brother just created his wardrobe and put this big bad guy in Crocs and now I'm laughing so hard because I cannot take any of the dramatic scenes seriously because I'm just picturing him in Crocs now. <laughs> What? Men's shoes, sandals. Yeah. I love them. Yeah, you are now. Yeah. <laughs> Just yeah, leave now. It's like almost midnight, but leave. Go buy me these right this second. <laughs> no. <laughs> Is that like a no dude or did you know? No. <laughs> Why? We we need to cut you off of Pinterest. You're grounded. No more Pinterest for you. You're finding the weird shit now. <laughs> You're gotten to the weird side of Pinterest. You looked up Crocs and now they're giving you weird dress well, shoe sandals. <laughs> and it literally gave you shoes, <laughs> shoe sandals. They're like dress shoes that have been cut into sandals. No. Some old man sandals right there. What level is Misty's star me? I can't remember. Oh, I gave a phone tap potato. Dang it. I think it's like level 22 or something like that. So we need to level up the Pikachu higher so it doesn't get like one shot by the Starmie. I can see him wearing his shirt. Like, his shirt. Doc? Doc Martens are like a black boot. They can be, in, they can come in other colors too. But the... Are you thinking like Timberlands? Yes. Those are like the the beigey, the beigey colored boots. You're like I know they start with a Tim, but I can't remember what they're called. Yeah, the the, the like the beige boots. Those yeah, those are Timberlands. I really hope the mic picked that up. I hope they did. <laughs> Some of the words you say. You're like, I can't be held accountable for what I say when I think about fictional characters. <laughs> That's a, that's a mood board if I've ever seen one. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, poisoned again. It's like incredibly frustrating. Yeah, 
poisoned again. I'm gonna have to run to the Pokemon Center again. I'm not wearing Crocs. The mom gave me running shoes I can breast be to run, so I'm wearing runners, not Crocs. I mean, they they could they could be um, they could be Crocs in sport mode. In like an hour, I should probably drink some water. Hydrate myself. Picture little toy haired tail Pokemon. Like little man bun? Yeah, he has like a little tail. He doesn't have like this much, but there's like it comes with a little tail. It's like a little tiny man bun that looks like him with his under eye. I mean, is Pinterest wrong though? I mean, Pinterest did send you on that goggy arc, and then not a week later, you're like, actually. A week later, you admitted that you liked him. What are you talking about? You were on like your big denial about it for a while there. But I, I called it. I was like, Pinterest knows something that you're trying to deny. Pinterest concerns me sometimes. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> That's like some fever dream level like imagery there. Sometimes I wonder about what timeline I'm in. Hmm. Yeah, I find that even for like reference photos and stuff for art, male hair is kind of hard to find. Yeah. Um, like you can always find lots of different like girl hair. And I think it's just like guys don't take as many pictures of their hair and like, but there's like lots of girls who like share what their hair looks like constantly. So I think that might be something to do with it. He honestly, he doesn't need hair. Yeah, he probably keeps his hair neat. Little fucking hair gel, and it, it, you knock on it, and it just turns down into a little bit. <laughs> so much hair gel, you knock on it, it sounds like wood. That's how you decided to describe his hair. It's add, we're adding that to the quote book. <laughs> he has so many different hairs. He goes for long to short. Look at him holding this lamb. Beautiful. That's for dinner, boys. <laughs> <laughs> lamb chops, anyone? What? Why are you laughing at that? <laughs> the way you're like, that's for dinner, boys. <laughs> When you only have one voice, so every impression you do sounds the same. <laughs> no, don't want to picture some big, tough, like bearded man <laughs> speaking with your voice. In my heart of hearts. He's like, look at this. 
only being a solar person. If you're the solar person, you can live to 2019. Wow. In a different timeline. Like we're working on this novel, but like you already have like a a, a fan fiction AU of like an alternate timeline version, just so you can make your favorite characters have a nice life. I love you. He's the only character I actually thought that was all opposite timeline. No one else. You're like I need an alternate reality where he has a good and happy life. Are you like thinking his like his conscience? <laughs> no. Thinking like Jimmy Cricket. <laughs> just on his shoulder. No, I was just thinking about like I'll be his inner spy. Oh. No, I'd be a horrible spy. Man. Double agent. <laughs> Eric's like, don't tell anyone this, Michael. He's like, aye aye. Tells everyone immediately. Like a love triangle? Yeah. And I want it. They better it. Oh, if nice. we ever get our book published and it gets big, I will know for a fact that you will be scouring the internet for good fan fiction. He looks green and yellow. Wow. Because he has the other model. I wonder if level 20 is high enough to burst the gym. It might be. Let's try. actually meaning to buy like eyeliner and stuff this payday and I totally just forgot to. Thinking about it now. Oh my god, look at his look at him wearing a dress. Wow. That's like some shit you don't see. I'm going through the good shit of Lucas's photos. Oh I'm gonna go to the Okay, we're going to save state just in case we don't beat the gym that way we can reload it without having to lose all our items and whatnot all right misty let's go You could like pick a watch that they wear or something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> a little kitty watch. Let me check the time. Jackson should have been back 20 minutes ago. Oh shit, the battery ran out. What about a ring? Yeah, you can pick like rings or watches or like necklaces. Like the guys wear jewelry too. Like you can pick accessories. Oop. 
Do we have a revive? <gasps> we do. I don't know what you're going on about either. The only superhero I can think of that wears the ring is like the Green Lantern. Instead of trying to attack, we're just going to heal. Egg. Use. Heal. There we go. Okay. Now Clemmy will faint and then we'll send Leaf back out and attack the Starmie. Hmm? Let's go, we beat Misty's gym. Uh, they can hear you slightly, like it picks you up a bit. Woo! In the background, they're like, what the hell? Ah. Cascade badge. Let's go. So Pokemon up to level 30 obey includes even outsiders you've gotten trades. There's more. You can now use cut anytime, even out of battle. You can cut down small trees to open new pathways. You can also use my favorite TM. TM03. TM03 contains water pulse. Use it on an aquatic Pokemon. Cool. Thanks, Misty. Yeah, I like I like my um lava rock bracelet. Like I like using it as like a fidget thing. Mm -hmm. But um when I'm on the computer, I can't wear it cuz it like clicks against the computer and it irritates yeah. me. What about this? Yeah, I can see that. Okay. I don't know any bracelets, but the only thing I know for clothes You can and I will. <laughs> I won't deny it. I'm mean enough to laugh at a man's Crocs. <laughs> well, you're, uh, I'm a hoe. <laughs> wow. Out where everyone can see it. You don't need to be ashamed of your crocs here, sir. My gosh. Fancy 
fancy socks. I love the socks that he wears it every day. Maybe Fools. I want a snake. Opening the fruit snacks. I've been going for an hour and 15 minutes. I need a snack. Of course you would. I love how the kids are going to be with me. What can I say? There's no- wait. Okay, Echo. But there's no other Crimson Wood member, I don't think. Crimson Wood can also be with me. Did you tell him you knew he was like a Yes. We were coming up with weird talents that all of the characters had. Would you just make bracelets? Mm hmm Make yourself friendship bracelets because you have no one to give them to? Wow, I didn't know we were close friends like that. Of course we are. Thank you. Puts it on self. I mean, sometimes I make bracelets for myself just because. Just whole ass scenarios you're acting out with yourself. <laughs> He seems like someone who would keep a pet snake. Yes. Jeffrey. Jeffrey the snake. I want a pet snake named Jeffrey. I just said that literally just because like if I have a snake that's a bracelet, I really like it. Oh. Probably. Ooh. You know, that's accurate. Did you even have that many scenes yet, did you? She had a couple. It's still kind of early to the She had more scenes than her brother. 
true. Switch your Pokemon around so we can level up. I'm not gonna lie, Eric is a man with energy. Necklace energy? Yeah. And he probably wears necklaces. He wouldn't. He doesn't wear like crazy ones. Oh. I can see him having like a silver chain or something he wears. Distract them with the accessories so they don't know about your terrible shoes. It's like an actual tactic. Yeah, that's how I know. <laughs> You're like, it's not something I do ever or anything like that. Jackson? Yeah. I can see him wearing muscle shirt, yeah. He gives me comfy energy. Just fucking baby ass shirt. It's kind of funny that like Crimson is just more on like comfortable than their store crushes. Mm. I feel like they don't have that in the store. Really? Yeah, I feel like you just wear what you have if you don't have access to like Shopping all the time, you know? Yeah. He's gonna be fucking jacked with this whole morning. I feel like he's gonna like go to the he's gonna go to the store and just like the first time when he goes to Silver Crescent and he'll be bright colors and that's good. <laughs> you mean you can buy clothes with colors? <laughs> Carpet rock. <block. laughs> this poor man's been living under a rock. We need to help him. Hello, unknown. How are you? How's your night going? Jackson is ring energy. Ring energy? Yeah. Well, he was like a fighter, so it would make sense for him to wear rings because, like that, like you know, punching someone with rings would hurt more. Um, I'm good. Just started red today. You started uh, Pokemon Red today? It's cool. We've been playing this one for a bit. We're letting followers name um, Pokemon as I catch them, so it's been fun. We've had a few weird names, but it's all good. We just beat uh, Misty's Gym and now we're heading down. I always forget that I make when I was like, what would our and I say this every time that I realize, and then I tell him muscle shirt, then I forget about it. And yeah. then the next time I'm like, oh, I wonder what Jackie wear, and I'm just like, oh, muscle shirt. It's like, yeah, it's, it's one of those things that you repeat constantly, and I'm just like, uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. I already found a way to make infinite money, and it's day one. Muscle. It's like an exploit, and it's automatic. Hmm. It's interesting. Not an exploit, just a way to make infinite money. That's interesting. I didn't know there was a way to do that. Just using the game. Hmm. That's cool. I actually always forget that muscle shirts are kind of show off muscles and I wear them just for fun. It's gambling? Like in the... Like in the game or like outside of the game, because that's kind of sus, dude. In game, I know, I know, like in um, Pokemon Red, they have the 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 the, the like Rockets game shop. 
but it's for like points. Talking about buff man cake, <laughs> Mikey, like really? Because I searched up muscle shirts and I can do the man's ass. <laughs> nice to know where your eyes are immediately drawn to, Michael. <laughs> Caught in 4K. <laughs> I mean, yeah, coins, not money. I got confused. Yeah, because like the, the coins can be used for like getting stuff, but it's not the same as like money. You can't buy everything with the coins. Um, already got the Porygon. Nice. It's an auto clicker. Hmm, I don't really mess with stuff like that usually. Time 16 speed. Interesting. I feel like car and air just always flex. They always flex? Yeah. They just like having flex socks in the mirror. They're like those tiny dudes in the box of <laughs> Thanks for the follow, unknown. Now that you're following, if you want, next uh, Pokemon we catch, you can name. Or if you have a specific Pokemon in mind that you would like us to catch and name, we can. Sure. Um... Oh yeah, we have to go... Let's see, we Lieutenant Surge. Alpha, and we just randomly just fucking get uh, <laughs> We need like a rock type. Although Ripper might not have too much of an issue. Need the cut ability, don't you? Yeah, I, I know. We have to go on the on the ship and talk to the captain to get cut. I know. I just couldn't remember which gym leader it was, because it's been a while. Yup, yup, yup. Fan club. Why do guys like walking around barefoot? I don't get it. Is there a You have a ticket? Yes, I do. I have the SS ticket. Let me on the ship. Thank you. <laughs> uh, so we shouldn't bother leveling up our Pidgeot, our Pidgeotto, because that's not going to help us against Lieutenant Surge. We'll just switch out our Nidorino. Miki Otaku, thank you for the follow. Holy crap. How's it going? Pikachu face palm. Why are we? Why is Pikachu face palming? What did I do? Great, you. Good. We just got on to the SS Annie, and now we're gonna level up our Nidorino, so that way we have a Pokemon that isn't particularly weak against electric type to face Lieutenant Surge after we get cut. We're doing a followers get to name Pokemon, so. Nothing will want to see if it worked. Oh, okay. Yeah, we have the BTTV emotes, so. Whatever in the info section, whatever's there should work. Kyle Dupan. Um, yeah, I could see that. Mm -hmm. 
I think my personal favorite out of the BTT emotes that I have right now is the Squirtle Jam one. We have a hype command for the beginning of the stream when we're blasting music at the starting soon screen and it like spams a bunch of the Squirtle Jam emotes. It's pretty pog. We also get Hayden um yeah. That makes sense for his character as well, yeah. Characters you made? No, just like in general. Oh. Hmm. One thing about the ship that's good is there's lots of trainers to like grind some levels before we get to the um, before we get to the new gym, which would be nice. Uh, he was hanging out. He might have, uh, he might be lurking or he might have left. I'm not sure. Came in and like at the very beginning of the stream demanding we name a Pokemon penis and then hasn't spoken since. Well, you... No, because the Pokemon he said he wanted to name that um, is a second gen Pokemon, so I can't exactly name it. It's a first gen game. Um, his redemption arc starts with that, yeah. He's like, like, he's like on his, like, he's almost dead and he like gets his escape room. Abandons like, him. Mom. Yeah. Mm. Gets him to start thinking for himself. Yeah, it's the start of his, like, redemption arc. <laughs> and then he's gonna die. Well, we don't know, but we talked about him dying. Imagine like going onto a cruise ship and then just bursting into people's rooms. I wish. Like the funny thing about this game. It's because like you could just walk into all the different rooms and it's like if you in reality if you were like on a cruise ship and just bursting into people's like cabins like that you'd get kicked off the ship. Like how you just drag in like people people like at least you can't go into their rooms so like you mm -hmm. just burst into them. Or like how it you can just um you can just like come into people's houses and like break all the pots in like Zelda and stuff like that. Realistically, you'd get kicked out and like people would get really mad, but video game logic. I don't know athletic wear. I don't know athletic wear. Like, if 
Athletic wear is like track pants or like um, sweatpants. Basketball shorts. Yeah. By that you mean he wears shorts lots, yeah. right? <laughs> He's definitely maybe never naked. See, some some of the things you say are a little bit sus. And... <laughs> I know, but just like without context, people hear what you say, they'd be like. It's like even for me sometimes I'm like sitting here and you say things without context I, and I hear it and I'm like what? <laughs> and then like after you explain it, yeah, sure, it makes sense. I'm like okay, but without context, it's just like um. What the fuck? I can't. I don't know athletic men. Athletic men are just beat an old man at a Pokemon battle and he gave me like almost two thousand dollars. Let's go. Although, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be like yen, so that's more like close to like $20. I should kill him. Wait, what do I mean? <laughs> I should beat men. Pokemon battle. We're not beating up old men, Mikey. Calm down. Uh, okay. <laughs> no, no wink. <laughs> old men are creepy, okay? Yeah, because old people definitely come into my stream. Just like someone's grandma's chilling here watching me play Pokemon. Maybe it's like a child and like their grandma's like watching to see what they do. hear you talking shit about old people and they're like, <gasps> That's too far away. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the mic can pick you up, but just a, a, enough for them to hear you shit talking. Well, they can hear my shit talk all the time, obviously. Poor old people. Wait, what was it going on? I don't know how I got the old people to like- uh, Because I told you I beat an old man at a Pokemon battle and he gave me a bunch of money afterwards and then you went on about how you're gonna beat up an old man. <laughs> it's like, someone's looking at like athletic crap. <laughs> Wait, what was that? Oh, Your Pinterest, like, FBI agent in control of like your Pinterest analytics is like, <gasps> this man has never- Worked out in his life. Why is he looking at athletic wear? I have like a little cut on my knuckle, and every once in a while, it stings when I bend my finger. You're mocking me. I'm sharing my discomfort with you and you mock me. It's fine. See if I ever open up and be vulnerable with you ever again. Fine, I'll be vulnerable. I'm sad. You're sad? Why are you sad this time? You having trouble finding the proper athletic wear for Jackson? Yeah. They're short shorts though. Let me picture Jackson in short shorts, please. Like, look at that. The black short shorts right there. Well, of course they s stun spore. He's not gonna worry. He's not gonna wear short shorts. He's gonna put his brother in his car. 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 
Oh, that's gonna one shot Clemmy. Oh, it didn't quite one shot Clemmy. If I manage to knock this Growlithe out with Clemmy, it's gonna like level up a bunch. Nope. It was worth a shot. Wow. No one would ever. His character is perfect. We love him dearly. He defeated Gentleman Thomas. Egg of Waffles? Yo, have you talked to Candace recently? You come into my chat with the audacity to try and land a Candace joke. The nerve of some people. Stop snickering over there, Michael. You hear the beginning of the, uh, of the joke and you immediately start snickering like the chaotic zoomer you are. The nerve of some people. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Egg of Waffles. Go I have to the Pokemon. No idea what I'm doing. Abs absolutely no idea what I'm doing. That's a mood. Anytime I go to- I'm, anytime I tell myself I'm gonna go to the gym and like work out, I immediately regret my decision. Because I get like overwhelmed by all the machines and stuff. Mom? What's up? Will the bread with, if um, Nate tells with like frozen bread, will it still turn out like fine? Yeah, you can make toast with frozen bread. Just throw it in the oven and it'll toast. Okay, you can. Oh, are the salmon like seeds? I mean, that would be sad if it's like. Why did you cook No, it's fine. You can you can toast frozen bread. It's chill, dude. Okay. <laughs> chill. <laughs> I didn't even mean for that to be a pun, but okay. Let's see, what Pokemon can we catch in this area? Spearow. Mm -hmm. So anyone here that just recently followed can um, name a Pokemon if we catch one. So if like you see a Pokemon that we um that appears in the wild that you feel like naming, let me know and I'll like catch one and you can pick a name for it. Providing that it follows like terms of service and whatever, obviously, but Oh, Auntie wants to learn horde attack. Um I mean, some athletic wear is kind of weird looking, not gonna lie. Um, it's kind of hard to see the brightness is turned down. Yeah, I can see more of that. My game just froze. I'm gonna 
you're like really salty if it like here. If it crashes, I'm gonna be upset because we saved like way before the gym battle. Probably. Not responding. No. The game crashed. Hello, potato. I'm having a sad moment over here. <laughs> you ooing and gasping in the background as I have my have my moment of sadness. Oh, I'm gonna have to do so much over again. I should have saved after the gym battle. A little loading arrow. No. Oh, wait. Okay, is it is it working now? Okay, we saved it at least. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna switch over to IRL for a second and we're gonna close this and reopen it because we saved it. We saved it. So at least we didn't lose progress. I'm gonna try and open it again. Here's hoping. Load. There we go, we fixed it. We fixed it, guys. We're good. <laughs> I was I was I was almost gonna cry. I was gonna be very upset. had to go back so far. No, I think I saved so after ca after catching them because I oh. saved right before we fought the gym. Oh. But I didn't save after the gym, so it would have been really annoying. I almost forgot my cat's name. <laughs> so gay. being paralyzed, so annoying. Ooh. Yeah, those look accurate. But yeah, I currently have three Pokemon in me. It's my Pokemon, which is on your team. Okay, um, Tato, you can't be in here, though, because, like, too many people talking and I'm gonna wake him up. So... And I'd rather not. You don't want to bother with him. True. I mean, he do be a character that dressed like a fuckboy. Yeah, no. Like fuck wasn't he a fuckboy before Minecraft? Yeah, that's accurate. Yeah, he was the first fuckboy. Well, his game was called Classic. New. Oh. There's a item. Awakening. It's actually kind of cute. You're just like, 
Okay, they're still here. Goes back to bed. Mm-hmm. True. Need to buy more Pokeballs so we can catch more Pokemon. Hmm? Like what shoes? Who wears? Jackson? Yeah. Mm, yeah. I can see him wearing Nikes, yeah. Definitely, he's, he has like a running shoe vibes, for sure. Um, it just depends which ones they are. We need more music. Oops. There we go. Okay. Well, my king of dogs just named Wolf. King of dog. I mean, you want a like a growlith and then turn into an Arcanine. I don't even know where you can find Growlithe in this game. If I can get a Growlithe, then I will, and then we can evolve it into an Arcanine at some point. Probably black. Yes, I can see if we can find um, Growlithe. I don't know where we would find one. I'll have to check. I'm gonna look it up. Growlithe Pokemon Fire Red. <laughs> Where do you find a Growlithe? No, I don't want to know what moves it learns, I want to know where you find it. Route 7 or 8, or the Pokemon Mansion. Okay, we'll have to go to, like, back to like Route 7 or 8 to find Growlithe. Mm -hmm. Well, I feel, yeah, she's a bad bitch, so like, I feel like she could probably kick anyone's ass while. She could kick anyone's ass wearing heels. Yeah, that too. She just, she learned how to do that. Yeah, we'll go and try and find you a Growlithe. For sure, for sure. Like, it was a funny bit while we were going on about it, but... Jordan's the only one across, and I'm standing by that. <laughs> I don't know, his face is like... Hey, yeah, there is.
Okay, route seven or eight. Uh, there should be. Can you uh, nuke me one of the barbecue ones? Hello waffles, how's it going? Good, that's good. Followers get to name Pokemon today. We're gonna try and find a... Oh, yeah, that's Route 6. How are the Pokemon? Pokemon are good. Where... Where's Route 7? We need to open the map. Catch a Dratini, name it Waffles. I mean, I when I find Dratini, he is a little bit more late game. But um, I'll try to keep, I'll try to remember that. Probably won't be till later in the game though. So like, if you if you're around later when we're in the area where Dratini is, then yeah, for sure. Um, it's my all-time favorite. Dratini is a cute one. Thanks for the follow, Waffles. Um. We do, we do the Fire Red every Wednesday, and that's when we name Pokemon, that's when followers get to name Pokemon. So, um, yeah, if we're, if we don't find a Dratini today, pop in on Wednesdays and can make sure that we name a Dratini when we find one. I want, like, Ralph was named to be Prince Wolf. When it evolves, rename him King Wolf. Uh, I mean, we could do that because there's the name Raider. Thank you. Pizza. Yes, I just got pizza. Okay, so if we go back through the so jelly, it's leftover pizza. We ordered it a little while ago. Oops. Okay, if we if we go back this way, it's even better. I mean, yeah, it is pretty good when it's leftover as well. Nope, not that way. This way. Try and find that growlith. Do you have any ghost Pokemon? No, we haven't gotten any ghost Pokemon yet. Not yet. Um, can't get ghost Pokemon till Lavender Town, and we haven't gotten that far. We just beat Misty's gym, and we're like gonna try and find. Uh, gonna try and fight Lieutenant Search soon. So. Any bee drills? No, because nobody wanted a, a Weedle or anything, so we never ended up catching one. Sad. Yeah, I wanted a bee drill, but nobody wanted one. Town map. Are we in Route 7 now? No, it's Route 5. And that's route nine. Mm. We're not gonna be able to get a Growlithe for a while. We have to get to one of these other areas first. Well, Beedrills are so cool. I do like Beedrill. I like Beedrill a lot. I thought we were able to get Growlithe here, but it turns out not. We have to wait until we get to the next area, I think. Boom, boom, boom. 
don't have to write that down. We need to find a Growlithe for potato, and we need to find a Dratini for waffles. I have to try and commit that to memory, which isn't, my memory isn't the best, but I will try. I promise I will try to remember. Just write it down. Yeah, I'll have to. I don't have a pen and paper right now, though. In order to progress, we need to finish the the ship so we can learn cut. So we need to get to a different city to find both. It's July. Oh, it is. It's finally July, yep. Yeah. Two days and it's my birthday. Oh. Because, um, everything, uh, uh, is the boat where you catch Mew? I actually don't know where you're supposed to catch Mew. I've never caught Mew before. I mean, I'll sing happy birthday to you on the third. I mean, we we um we stream on Friday, and our stream usually goes past midnight, which means we will stream into your birthday, so we can sing happy birthday on stream. No. <laughs> Mikey's Unless like, Dusty please, <laughs> please do not. Dusty we'll have to invite Dusty to your birthday stream. Okay. Dude, horse. <laughs> Ayo, hey, hey, Henry. I love this game. I love this game too. Lots of nostalgia. Like it's a ball form, the horsey. Horsey's a ball form is pretty cool looking, yeah. I'm gonna shelter coming out here with the ice spikes. What the heck? So toaster sandwich decks. I'll do you one better, a toasted sandwich. Oh my god, that's so nostalgic. Pretty nostalgic, yeah. I'm a dragon type trainer. I'm typically um, a normal type trainer. I like to collect all like the cutesy normal type Pokemon. My favorite um, Pokemon, Skitty. If you weren't able to tell from the alerts, I mean, some of the normal types turned into fairy types in the newer games, but. In this one, most of what I've been catching has been based on what the followers want, so I've been playing with Pokemon I don't normally play with. I spend at least 11 hours making my Pokemon teams. I like to have the perfect team. Yeah, I'm, I'm one of those, those trainers that just collects all the cute Pokemon and do my best with the Pokemon that I think are cute. Never been one for like perfecting like stats and like abilities and all that. I would be amazed if you catch a Dratini. I will try my best. I'm that type. Bo Burnham now. We'll watch Bo Burnham, Mikey. I promise. We'll watch the Bo Burnham special. I maxed out my Pokemon. Yeah. <laughs> now, bitch. Soon, soon, I promise. I'm too perfectionist. Um, I am for certain things, but for Pokemon, I play just for fun. My favorite is Mr. Mime. It's been two hours. I know it's been two hours. Mikey, I know it's been two hours. 
perfection is fun. I mean, some people find perfection fun. I find that pursuing perfection causes me anxiety. And then I end up procrastinating and doing absolutely nothing. So we try to avoid perfection. So wise. I mean, it's just kind of learnt behavior. I realized that I would um, procrastinate and avoid doing things because I felt like I wasn't able to do them perfect. And then as I got older, I realized doing something um, not perfectly is better than doing nothing at all. <laughs> so at least if you, if you do something half-assed, it gets done at least, right? Better than not doing it. Collecting brisk bottles is fun. You like forming a collection of brisk iced tea bottles. That's beautiful. Thank you, I'm glad you appreciate my wise words. I like to st study everything about the game I'm going to play. I mean, that's one way to do it. So true, good job. <laughs> I'm the kind of person that, that just like jumps into things without researching anything half the time. Kind of like sink or swim. Hey Dax, yes Mikey, what's up? I'm your number one hater. Mikey runs my hater account. He runs all the- any Daxity anti account you find on Twitter is run by Mikey. I wish. I'm not big enough to have like hater and anti accounts for me yet. I don't even have stan accounts yet. So you have me. Well get on it then. Start spreading your anti-Daxity propaganda because then they that will attract people to figure- be like, who is this Daxity and why does this person hate me so much? You have me. Fucking bitch, loser, hate you. See, if anyone else came in here doing that, they would get banned for being rude and mean, Mikey. You can't just flaunt, flaunt your, your mod badge and sprout, spout hate in my direction. Well, I'll, I'll ban myself. If you look on Discord photo booth, you can see the palace stuff. Yeah, I saw I saw it in Discord earlier, Potato. You're the best. See you next time. Uh, thanks for hanging out, Waffles. Thanks again for the follow. I'll make sure to keep an eye out for the Dratini. back to find stuff for Jackson. See you later, Lisa. Okay, you have fun, Mikey. I run the stop Mi Mikey's hate Dax rant leader. I'm sure that sentence was supposed to make sense, but my brain could not comprehend it. The stop Mikey's hate Dax Like you have, you're, you're, you're an anti, an anti, you're my, okay, how could, a hate account for my hate account? Is that what you're trying to say? Probably. Makes sense. I had to think about it really hard. My brain almost fried. That's okay. Okay, bye. Bye, Mikey. We're probably gonna, um, after this battle, we're probably gonna end stream because I have been going for like two hours and it's like 1 a.m. Yes, we'll watch Bo Burnham. Um. Is there. 
Anyone live right now that we can raid? Is Agua live? Hmm. Oh, oh, if you if you want to look up a, a random that looks friendly, we can uh, send a raid over that way. See if they're playing a, a, a Pokemon and then... It doesn't really matter which Pokemon because I'm sure anyone... People would be happy with whatever. I'm not raiding someone huge. Because they, I don't know, I'd, r I'd rather like raid someone who's relatively small because then I'm like helping out another viewer, you know? Agua's live? I know Agua's live, but um, I don't think he's playing Pokemon. I'd rather raid someone who's playing Pokemon if we're ending up a Pokemon stream, you know? Hmm, let's go look. Mm. Let's see. Pokemon Platinum has lots of viewers right now. Boo boo boo. Who were you looking at? What are they playing? Let's see. Very red. <laughs> Let's see if we can find someone with a webcam with some like lower viewers, I guess. Boop, 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 boop. Where are they? Wow. I can't wait to have burp, dog, cat, and insect. I mean, yeah, we'll, we'll get a bunch. Can whatever Pokemon you feel like, we can attempt to catch for sure. I'm looking at this person who has four viewers. What's their username? I'm watching an ad right now. I can't. I want to see how they respond. Oh, okay. So low volume. Just like, so. Okay. But we are going to soul ship. So so. Is so socials I'm gonna end stream so if you're interested you can check out socials and the discord we'll be playing um undertale on friday and more pokemon on monday play the skitty run on monday so you... they're, they're, they're famous booktubers. are they a vtuber yeah. send me their uh username and we'll send the raid over that way What? Low volume? Yeah. Low volume underscore. Okay, we'll send a raid over that raid over that way. And thanks for hanging out.
gonna we're gonna set the raid over. Bye bye. If they didn't speak in the chat because I'm not verified.